Hey everyone, Uncle Man Full Floyd, I probably shouldn't have started it yet. Welcome back to my channel, I'm in the studio. We have a lot to catch up on guys, but I thought I'd just take you along. <laughs> I thought I'd take you along for the ride today because it's a busy one. I've just had my friend in the studio doing a self tape for a casting, which was, she smashed it. Now I've got pamper party, then I've got baby shower, and then I've got two museum content creators slash influencers coming into the studio to make some brand content ready for the launch of their podcast. There's a bit of wrap. <laughs> I will fill you in with all things renovation, fitness, etc. very soon. But enjoy a day in the life. <laughs> Charlotte! Sorry. <laughs> no! no. <laughs> I wanted a candid photo. <laughs> I love it. Sorry. You look so confused in this part. I felt like you were giving Marilyn Monroe yeah. vibes. I was, I, you are giving Marilyn Monroe, you always mm. do. I always get that comparison actually. I was like, maybe I am her, but I, you know, in her, oh, this is amazing. Oh, I want some content though. Back in the studio, we are doing a podcast, a branding content. I've lost my camera. Why am I so chaotic? <laughs> I I've got the girls here. Anyway. I need a bit of Zara, a bit of Zara, yeah, Zara. I'm going to go get the... Her three-year-old is the most sassiest friend. Oh. In, in the most amazing way, though. Like, give her energy. I love this. <laughs> okay, are you ready, girls? <laughs> Introduce yourselves. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's a bit frustrating. <laughs> I'll do it, fine. Okay, okay, go. I'm still filming. Hi, I'm Faye. This is Charlotte, and we are Mamas on a Mission. Woo! <laughs> so let me know it after all. <laughs> so if they've got it up and running, I will put the podcast link down below as well. Make sure you go and listen. Yes, yes. What platform is it going to be on? Uh, all of them: Spotify, YouTube, all, yeah, all of the platforms. Yeah, 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 yeah. Carrier pigeon, everything. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> The chaos of motherhood. <laughs> girls are oh, just walked into a farm. The girls are absolutely smashing it. And we're just setting up another scene. I'll flip it around and show you. So we're going to do chaotic motherhood um, amongst the glam. Fun, fun, fun. Woo. Hey guys, I'm back in the studio today. It's Sunday morning. Um, so it's not a daily vlog, it's going to be a weekend vlog and maybe, I don't know, <laughs> maybe into a little bit longer, it depends how long it's going to take me to oh, do everything. Let's pop you there. I'm just going to put some bits in. Oh. I swear on my vlogs, I'm literally just like hurting myself or making noise. That's not going to go there, is it? I just wanted to update you guys on where I'm at at the moment with lots of things. So, oh my God, I just don't even know where to start. Okay, so fitness wise, do you know what? I was smashing it in the summer holidays. Um, I weighed myself here and there and I was like, okay, I'm maintaining my weight, which is great because I went to like Peppa Pig World and, you know, there's a certain type of food when you go away and like when you're going to theme parks and stuff. I tried as much as I can to take picnics with me when we went out for the day, which was great and it worked really well. I was doing a few workouts a week with the kids and obviously doing lots of steps. But the last two weeks, no, the last 10 days of the summer holidays, I'm not really sure what happened, but I just, my exercise went down, my food got worse. It was my stepdaughter's 13th birthday as well. So that didn't help. Um... So yeah, it kind of went off and I've, I've definitely put a couple of pounds on. I can feel it in myself. And although I'm all about the body confidence and stuff like that, I feel better a bit smaller than this. And I just want to be super fit. So I'm really missing the exercise. I'm going to try and implement it again from next week. I've done a couple of workouts this week, but like two. That's not enough for me. I would work out every day if I could and have the time. Um, I've got lots of changes happening with my businesses. I've had my coil removed as well because my PCOS flare-ups were just horrific. And I thought, you know what, I just need to try it. Um, and I've not actually had any cramping and pains since having that out. So touch wood, I mean, obviously it's still early days. I think I had it out like three weeks ago. 
Oh, there's so much to catch up on. Right, I need to do this bin bag because my client's going to be here in five minutes. I'll fill you up again in a minute. Fill you up? Fill you in in a minute. Okay, it's me. I'm back. And I didn't catch up, did I? No. Guess what day it is today? It's Thursday. Basically, guys, where am I at? Hmm. <laughs> I'm meant to be running a 10K next weekend, so in 10 days. It's not going to happen. Um, my foot just has not really repaired itself at all. Um, it's not bad, like I can run on it, but to do a 10K when I've not been running enough, it would just be silly, so I won't be doing that race. Um, and I'm actually thinking of starting like the Couch to 5K again, which I know you're going to be like, why are you doing that? You've just run a marathon in April. Um, because I want to get faster. I want to get more competent. And it will just be fun to have something to target for. Or I might... I don't know. I'm going to do something around my running. But I'm really enjoying the strength training. I have had my call out. And I haven't had ovary pain. I'm feeling less bloated. Um... The summer holidays did get to me in the end and it's taken me a little while to get back on track. Uh, I don't know how much I said on here previously, but my eldest son has ADHD and ASD, autism. And he's been between two schools and was meant to be slowly transitioning back. So I have to drive loads of different places. He's on reduced hours. It's a lot to fit in. Um, but there's some really big changes happening and I feel like I'm, I don't want to put it, I, I don't want to jinx it, but I feel like he is settling back at his original school and he's doing well. We're looking at senior schools and yes, I've got my really busy season coming up, end of October and throughout November for all my Christmas shoots. The renovation is still going strong. Um, so much to do. <laughs> And we literally have no time, um, money as well. Like, we when we moved in here, we hadn't budgeted for the boiler going within literally months of us being here. There's been loads of things, basically. And, yeah, we're saving to do more renovating. Sorry, this, like angling and stuff isn't good is it i'm just leaning on my clean washing that i still haven't put away um so i don't know why you're here because jen's blend is a mix of everything and if you've made it this far thank you because this has been the shittest vlog in history but up to update you pcos there's a few things i've been doing and it's definitely relieving my symptoms berberine every morning um and i'm gonna try and implement a few more things diet wise hmm I'm doing okay. I've had a few blips here and there, especially towards the end of summer holidays and just like with the stress of things. But I'm I'm keeping, I'm either maintaining or I'm doing a very small loss, which is what I want to do long term. So that's fine. Exercise wise, it's been on the back burner. It's not been a priority and I really, really miss it. And I am literally going to sit down with my diary and block in next week every single one of my sessions and what I'm doing. I think I'm actually going to go to the pool. I've been doing my um, my bungee um, in the pool, but it's getting bloody cold. <laughs> so I think we're actually going to drain the pool soon. I don't, I think summer's over, isn't it? Summer is over. Photography wise, business wise, there's a lot of stuff going on. I'm actually really enjoying the content creating and I've always just done my youtube for fun i love making videos i love editing like when everyone else is sitting watching tv i like to edit like my videos and like my stuff of my kids together and just i just like it it's like a like creative outlet so my tiktok and my instagram have just like really taken off and i'm loving it and it's actually bringing in like quite a lot of opportunities. I've actually just been accepted as a brand ambassador for Curvy Kate, which is one of my absolute favorite brands. And they've sent me a lovely lingerie set to model for them. Um, so head over to my TikTok or Instagram and please support it because I am so excited. And although it's, you know, it's a small step to be acknowledged by such a big brand, I'm not going to be like their face of their next campaign. You just... You just don't know, and I've been sent lots of samples from TikTok shop, TikTok, TikTok shop, and 
it's just amazing. I feel like my business is transforming in a different way. I can feel my spark coming back. Um, I had something really hanging over my head the last 18 months, which is now done with. Um, obviously, I have the daily things to deal with with my son, but that's fine. That's, you know, that's something for life and some days are harder than others, like this morning. Um, but yeah, I have a lot, a lot, so much to share, so much to share and so very little time. So I'm just going to upload this as like a bit of an update video and then... I'm going to do like more regular videos. Do I need to do it at a certain day and time or would everyone be happy just to watch when and whenever? Let me know. Please subscribe and come back. Please watch my videos. Why is this so beggy? Okay, don't. If you want, to, no, do. But only do it if you want to. <laughs> and I'll put my TikTok and Instagram down below if you want to come and see um me on other platforms because i'm posting literally daily on tiktok my stories on instagram plus um grid posts and stuff so yeah this was a massive ramble and i say about my eldest son having adhd and it's genetic and i am definitely an undiagnosed adhd girl without question um <laughs> so thank you for putting up with my rambling and I'll see you in the next video. It could be anything. It could be fitness. It could be business. It could be life. It could be fashion. What would you like? Let me know. And I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>